Hello everyone, I hope you're all doing well. I'm Kirti Sophia Ponachin and in today's session we'll be continuing print media and this is part 2. Journalism is one of the most important professions in the world. It informs citizens about various events that take place in their community, state, country and world. The reports of journalists help people to form opinions and know the current affairs. Journalists inform the public through newspapers, magazines, radio, television and websites. These means of communication are often referred to as news media. Everyday journalists throughout the world gather, write and edit material for thousands of news stories. Local reporters cover local events. Other journalists, including foreign correspondents, cover national and international news. Another team edits the news stories. News organizations have an enormous responsibility to help people to understand today's increasingly complex and fast changing world. The obligation of the media to keep the public informed through fair, accurate and complete reporting has never been greater. The words journal, journalist and journalism have their origin in a French derivation from the Latin term diurnalis which means daily. A journalist is different from a creative or fiction writer. A journalist primarily reports and interprets news and events. On the other hand, a fiction writer primarily intends to entertain. Now let's see what are the roles and responsibilities of a journalist. Press is a public service and therefore it is accountable to the community as a whole. Press freedom means not only the freedom from unnecessary restraints but also freedom for advancing certain basic and desirable concepts enshrined in the value systems of the community. The press is an important vehicle of communication, a vital instrument in the creation of public opinion as well as an indispensable element for the survival of any democratic setup. Hence, it is necessary that journalists should regard their work as a noble profession. The principles, aims and objectives of journalism will vary from country to country depending on the social, economic and cultural differences. Still, there can be certain principles which are central to the profession of journalism and accepted so by people. Some of these principles are given below. The first one is people's right to true information. People have the right to acquire an objective picture of reality by obtaining accurate and comprehensive information as well as to express themselves freely through various media. The second one is dedication to objective reality. The foremost task of the journalist is to serve the people's right to true and authentic information through dedication to objective reality. So, a journalist should give the people 
true and authentic information through their news. The third one is social responsibility. A journalist shares responsibility for the information transmitted. He or she is accountable not only to the proprietors of the media but also to the public at large. So it is a very responsible position. Fourth one, professional integrity. The social rule of the journalist demands that he or she should maintain high standards of integrity. The integrity of the profession does not permit the journalist to accept any form of bribe or the promotion of any private interests contrary to general welfare. Moving on to the fifth point, public access and participation. The nature of the profession demands that the journalist promote access by the public to information and participation of the public in the media, including the right of correction or rectification and right to reply. So the public has a very important role in journalism activities. They should be given a space to give their opinions and uh, their suggestions. The sixth one is respect for privacy and human dignity. An integral part of the professional standards of the journalist is respect for the right of the individual to privacy and human dignity. So, human beings should be given their own privacy if they ask for and no one should humiliate or degrade their dignity. The seventh one is respect for universal values and diversity of culture. A true journalist stands for universal values of humanism such as peace, democracy, human rights, social progress and national liberation. Thus, a journalist participates actively in the social transformation towards democratic betterment of a society. Moving on to the eighth point, elimination of war and other great evils confronting humanity. The commitment to the universal values of humanism calls for journalists to abstain from any justification for or incitement to wars of aggression and arms race. Journalists should also try to eliminate all forms of violence, hatred or discrimination, especially racism, oppression, colonialism as well as other greater evils which afflict humanity such as poverty, malnutrition and depreciation. Moving towards the ninth and last point, promotion of a new world information and communication order. The journalist should aim at decolonization and democratization of the fields of information and communication both nationally and internationally on the basis of peaceful coexistence among people and with full respect for their cultural identities. So that's all for today. I hope today's session was fruitful for you all. If you enjoy watching my videos, do subscribe to my channel and give a big thumbs up to all the videos that you absolutely loved watching. And don't forget to share these videos to those who love learning English. Once again, thank you so much. Have a nice day.